Hi guys, um, just going to run through a new concept with you. This new concept is called Floss Words. And this is the floss rule. Okay, so the rule is you need to double the consonant F, L, S or Z when they appear after a short vowel in a one syllable word. Tricky to know. Okay, so what we want to do, we're going to practice writing this. We're going to write the word hill. Okay, now we're going to sound it out. I, U. Let's write it just as we've sounded it out. I, U. So what we want to look for in a floss word is, is it a one syllable word? Hill, yes. So it's one syllable. Yep, we can give that a tick. Yep. Then we have to see if there is a short vowel. A short vowel. Let's sound it. H, I, O. Yep, there's, there's the short vowel right there. So short vowel. Yep, we can give that a check. Does it have an F, an L, an S, or a Z at the end? F, L, oh there it is, floss. F, L, S, or Z. Does it have one of those? Yes, it has an L. So is there an F, an L, an S? or a Z at the end. Yep, we've got the L. So what do we need to do? We need to double the consonant. We need to have the second one on there. That's how you spell hill and that's the floss. Um, the floss rule. Okay, let's try another word. Let's try uh, a word that ends with Fluff. Let's do fluff. Okay, let's sound it out. Ready? Fluff. F U A. <laughs> let's do it again. F U A. Okay, let's write it as we hear it. Fluff. U A. There it is. F U A. Fluff. Now let's see what we're checking for first. We have to check, is it one syllable? Is it one syllable? You test it. Fluff. Check your chin. Fluff. Yeah, I think that gets a tick. Yep, it's definitely one syllable. Let's see what else we have to check for. Is there a short vowel sound? F, U, A. The vowel sound is A. Uh. Is that short? Yes. So, short vowel. Let's give that a check. Now we have to see, does it end with F, L, S or Z? Let's have a look. F, L, S or Z, what does it end with? F, yeah, so we've got that one as well. Great, it's another floss word. F. L, S, or Z. Yep, we've got a check there. So, if it gets three checks, what do we need to do? We need to double that consonant. Give it two. Great. Awesome. Let's try, um, I think we're going to try one more. Let's do the word bus. Ready? B, A, S. Okay, let's write it as we say. Let's sound it. B. Oh, can you 
see that? Hang on, sorry. Come the wrong way. That's it. B. A. S. Bus. Okay. Let's check. First, we check that it's one syllable. Bus. Yep, it's one syllable. One syllable. We can give that a check. Uh, the next thing we had to check for was if there is a short vowel. B, A, S. The vowel is A. Uh, is that short? Yeah, it is. We can give it a tick. Oh, sorry, wrong colour. Short vowel. Give that one a check. Uh, now, the next one we had to look for was... F, L, S or Z at the end. F, L, S or O, S. Yes. Let's go F, L, L, S or Z. We have the S on that one. We can check. Yep. Then if that we've got three checks, we can double the consonant. Hang on a minute. That's not how you spell bus. That's how you spell bus. I think we found us a rule breaker. We're going to see if we can find some more of those through the week. So our new concept for this week is floss words. <laughs>